Uh. All right, make sure we're live. I think we're live. Are we live? Let's see. Can I go to the channel? Yes, we are. What's up, guys? What's going on? How y'all doing? Let me hear what's my What's up, volume. guys? What's going on? How y'all doing? Okay, cool. Not super loud. What's up, guys? What's going on? Yep. All right, what's up? What's up? What's up? How y'all doing, man? Good to see y'all. <laughs> All right, so in less than four minutes, Microsoft is about to do the Inside Xbox show. I'm going to let the room fill up. Hey, Craig, jump in the chat. Uh, I'm in here, bro. Jump in here if you want. If you got time, jump on in here because uh, I'm about to shock all you guys. Um, Sony just blew us. Sony just dropped the jewel before Microsoft's official um, Inside Xbox show. Now, granted, Inside Xbox is not necessarily, you know, a show they go over the top with. It's never been like that. But even I'm looking at it, I'm like, yo. <laughs> So he just came out and dropped the damn controller for DualShock 5, for the for the uh, PS5. This is now being called the DualSense. Now, you guys remember before uh, we covered patents on this on the channel, I've covered everything about this controller. I've talked about it. I've done a video about it numerous times. I've actually, you know, talked about this. This controller has enhanced, vi you know, um, it has enhanced uh, vibration in the actual uh, controller, but it has the new haptic feedback triggers. The triggers are a lot bigger. This damn controller, which I'm about to show on the screen in one sec. I'm just waiting for everybody to get in here. Go ahead, share it around for your boy. I appreciate it. Um, share this around. Let's, let me put this on Twitter. Uh, one second. Give me one second. I'm I'm literally. I was getting ready to go live about something else, and then they did this. So, hold on. Hold on. Let me see. Whoops. <laughs> I don't know what I just did. I think I closed my screen, didn't I? Yes, I did. All right. Well, anyway, this this uh, blew me away. I'm shocked by what I just saw. <laughs> Uh, we are live. We are live. And, and we're going to definitely put this on the screen for all you guys. Uh, where are we? Living? Okay, cool. So make sure everybody gets it. So everybody gets a chance. Okay, cool. Let's go ahead and get back to the stream. Sorry about that. Had to shut this down. <laughs> what's up, everybody in the chat? My bad. I didn't even say what's up. What's up, everybody? How, how y'all doing? What's up, uh, Chris? Everybody who was here earlier. What's up, Dawn? I see you. Um, everybody else. The Messiah, you in here? What's up? Uh, what's happening? All right. Well, I know you're looking at the stream, so let's go ahead and put this controller on here. I know you're looking at like, yeah, let's see this controller. Y'all ready for this? Here we go. Let me go ahead and put this up. Introducing the DualShock 5, guys. There it is. Now, this right here has a two-toned look right here. Um, it's going to have, obviously, you're going to have different colors, like black and, and uh, stuff like that. But this is uh, the color, the white color right here. This is a two-tone look they went for for this design. Kind of makes you wonder. Shout out to Blaze. I know he's live right now, but he's going to jump in here as well. Um, they're kind of, a lot of people are thinking that maybe we're going to have a, uh, another one, another, like a white console type of design, maybe. So um, there's talks going around about that. Here's the back of it. The triggers are bigger. Like we talked about in the patents, they actually looks like they added rubberized material on the sides here for extra grips. And of course the D pad and everything else of that nature on this controller looks definitely a lot more snug. The D, um, the touchpad, obviously they kept the touchpad because PS5 will work with PS4 games and you already know the PS4 games use the touchpad and it's kind of integral to how those games work. So they need that on there. Now, let's get even further into this. <laughs> this right here more than likely is the brand new share button. I'm thinking that's what that is. That's the new share button. The only thing that I kind of don't necessarily, I'm not blown away by, and you might look at me weird for this, but it's this right here. I was kind of expecting them to have a circular PlayStation logo button 
for the bottom of the controller, but they just went with just the logo itself. I mean, it's a minor nitpick, but that's what they went for for this actual look. The share button itself, though, looks pretty sick. I must say. It looks pretty sick. It's a thick boy. So what? It's a thick boy, okay? It's that that control, controller is thick. You can dip out, sir. Get in. <laughs> All right. Sorry about that. But no, nah, that's what they, they got going on there. So it looks pretty fine. It looks uh, fine. Um, uh, some of you might like this, though. Some of you might, might like this. Y'all might say this looks flush. I mean, yeah, it's flush against the controller for design for sure. But it's not necessarily... You get what I'm saying? It doesn't It doesn't have the circular look at all. But there's the share button itself, the D-pad, the analog sticks. And here's, again, another shot of it from the uh, the back here. USB-C, we talked about this before. USB-C is indeed going to be on this for uh, this controller and, of course, uh, Xbox Series X. So they're both rocking that. Yeah. Um, Oh, it's the create button now. Okay, see, I thought it was a uh, share button. Now, I'm, I'm so used to calling it the share button, but okay, create button. Let's see. Show the back. That is the back. This is the back race. They got the Sony logo and all that on there. So, And um, if you want a black look for this, I think I saved it. Did I not save a black look to this? No, I did not. Oh, yes, I did. Let me. Oh, you did. There you go. Here's a black look for it. This is how it could look in black. That looks stealthy, to be honest with you. That looks a lot better in black. Yeah. <laughs> Granted, this was made in Photoshop, but here's a better, here's a better representation of what you're more like you're gonna get uh, when we get to the actual release. That's a huge bitch. So, I wish they could have kept the same colors for the for the X circle and triangle <laughs> squared. Well, Car shout out to two dollar holler Carlos Crespin said that the new rumor has been started that the the, con the controller will now overheat. <laughs> Shout to Carlos. <laughs> oh, Ironically, uh, I made it big on the screen, and the alert came out just in time for me to do that. So that was funny. <laughs> anyway, oh, no. so there you guys oh, go, well, man. Dual Shock, uh, Dual Shock Four or Dual Shock Five is now being called the Dual Sense. It's no mm -hmm. longer being called Dual Shock. They changed the name from Dual Shock to Dual Sense. Mm -hmm. And again. Remember, this has a sense of touch to PS5 gameplay. Guys, remember haptic feedback controls? They're talking about what was that? What was that feature where the controller can detect your sweat or something like that? Your heart rate? I'm guessing that's probably why they're going with that too. So whatever else they're doing, this is another thing they're gonna be adding to it in general. But so far though, I ain't gonna lie, it looks pretty damn slick. They kept the light bar, which a lot of us thought we we're gonna get rid of. They kept it. Uh, it's underneath the actual touchpad here. So these are this blue light on the back more than likely will yeah. change color depending on the user. So if your player two will turn red or you know whatever color you want. Obviously well, PC is going to be a different story. You can just change it <clears throat> at will to whatever color you want. No issues. Yeah. So um, that's what they're going for. What's up, Aaron? Thank God they they, they got rid of it on the back. That's that well, the two tone. Well, here, here's here's something know. that might be more your alley, uh, Aaron. <laughs> here's here's well, something that might be more your alley. I don't see what the big deal is here. I mean, um, it's a gamepad. It's a gamepad? Well, the they showed the controller well, now, remember, inside on. Xbox. Same, it's literally happening right of, now. Well, the same group of people were mocking the Xbox coming to time for getting excited about controllers. Now, <laughs> oh, now, God. Here, now, now the same group of people that were mocking them are getting excited about a gamepad. I mean, that's all this is. <laughs> oh, it's a wow. gamepad. Yeah, so, I mean, got I don't full thing. So this is pretty is. cool. They legit broke the internet like yeah. that. Quick, well, I mean, so. I'm not here to say that I'm glad people are excited about it, but um, to me, it's just a it's a game pad. Uh, Yo, I mean, get out of here, Craig. I mean, I would say the same thing when the Xbox. It's just a game out. pad, bro. Yeah, it's a game pad. Yeah, you understand the world stop when they drop the logo? What do you think is going to happen? Show that. control. Yeah, that's, that's fine. That's Get him, Blaze. Get him, Blaze. Get him. Uh, uh, Get him, Blaze. I mean, this looks okay. <laughs> I mean, I'm not going to start a big deal to me. Get him, Blaze. Like, well, okay. Yeah. This shit Craig look like bro. a fucking Tesla, bro. This control looks like a Tesla. <laughs> like it looks sleek, man. Well, that's what, that's what the, they say about the Xbox Elite gamepad. Is it not oh, big God. now? Like, oh, how much oh. better it's going to be? I mean, well, the Xbox Series S controller looks exactly the same as um, the uh, Xbox One. They just changed the, the actual oh, well, they improved. You see, Microsoft fine. they're scared yeah. of change, bro. No, that um, it looks exactly the same. They changed the um, the triggers and, and gave it the the share button. I think on the right. That was it. 
It was exactly the same. Well, they, I was they, saying, they yeah, somebody in the now. chat said that they're they're thirsty, but okay, if you're going to get this excited over a controller, then do not mock the community when they come out with a new controller. Just don't say nothing else because that's what you guys sound like. Bro, but Craig, the it's difference a, is a, Microsoft releases controllers like their games. Like, check I out agree. our new game. Oh, no, I it's agree. just a controller. No, you know like what I mean? Hepatic, yeah, it's nice <laughs> to see the bigger buttons for the hepatic feedback. I'm not saying that it's not. It's just not as big a deal as people are making. It's not like, well, this is okay. Uh, you know, it's just not that big a deal. I got to uh, be honest, though. My first initial reactions, I'm like, what? You was like, what the hell is that? And I, I didn't think it was real neither until more so it's called it. I was like, oh, shit. Well, because on it? Twitter, it says PS5 console. And I thought they used yeah, the yeah, console. Yeah, we all thought console. I'm like, oh, what's the console look like? Yeah. That's fine. But uh, if, now, who, for, for I know, they may release the console tomorrow. You know, but yeah, so know. people people are speculating that uh, Nike they're they're saying that could it be possible that PS Five will be a like a two tone color design when we first get it? I don't think mm -hmm. it's going to be two tone colored when we get it. I think more likely they're going to go with piano black. That just seems to be the metric for both consoles. They always do this. They go for like you know the piano black just to get it out there out the door. Yeah, but I, they, I, they usually uh, do. Here's the thing. Yeah. Well, 360, 360, 360 didn't though at the start. Three sixty was white but you get what i'm saying they usually go with the two-tone colors and, and different colors a little later it's no, gonna yeah. be white and it's gonna be black it's gonna match yeah. the controller they can't yeah. release a black so you think the control you think the console's black and the controller's white and black no no i think the i think the console is gonna uh reflect the controller that's what i think it's gonna be the exact same they're gonna probably have a two-tone spin to it and it's gonna be white and black bro imagine having this controller with a black console that don't look weird to you yeah, it, Yo, it, 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 it needs would. to look. It, really it needs to look seamless. You know, they can't just show off a black console with this white, bright controller. It wouldn't look right. I'm telling you, it's gonna be. It's gonna be the same, bro. Yeah. But traditionally, yeah. Ryan, you're right. Traditionally, they always put out that piano black. They always oh. put out piano black. Yeah, yeah, piano black. So more likely, it's gonna look like this when we get it. More likely, gonna yep. look this one. The only thing, the only I gripe that I have with this controller. But again, again, I, I'll probably get used to it because I probably won't be looking at it as much. It's just this small thing right here, that little PlayStation logo at the bottom. That's the only thing other than that. Look I I, I really wish they sh put should have put it silver instead. That way it would stand out more. Yeah, probably. It almost does look silver as she, but you know, I just wish, like you said, we said on my stream, Ryan, like I wish it was like a round, like a round circle. Like, yeah, keep yeah, the, like logo, the logo. Yeah, keep like the, the logo, logo with the round circle. Yeah. Yeah, that would have been fine. Other than that, I mean, no issues. Uh, it's got a mute button at the bottom, what it looks like. looks like a mute button. Yep. So yep. that's Absolutely. interesting. Yeah, that's interesting how they did that. Pretty much, though, the entire bottom. And they're not the calling it the DualShock 5. Did you hear yeah. that? The, dual, yeah. the, the, the bottom dual of this sense. controller looks pretty much identical, if you think about it, to uh, what you got right now with DualShock 4. Looks and pretty much identical. The... Looks a little identical. Right, did you show that off that other angle from the side? Did you show that off? Yeah, I showed off of it. Which, the, uh, let me put it back on. Like this one? Yeah, that one. Yeah, so right there, you see, you know, whatever. You got USB C, thank God. And then, uh, <laughs> thank God. You know, it just, you look at those analog sticks. They got that, they, first of all, they kept it concave and not dome, thank God. And then they got that nice little texture around the analog stick. Hopefully, it's not hard texture like Xbox, like you yeah. should rip some of your thumbs and shit. But, um,. Oh, it sure. looks it looks nice, man. It looks sleek. It, it looks, looks sleek. Like a... It looks a lot sleek. It looks a lot better than I thought it was. I remember I was thinking the whole time, how do you balance the new one and still maintain a look that kind of complements the old one? Because you remember they got it. Yeah. They have to keep this. I know a lot of people probably don't want the touchpad, but they have to keep the touchpad to make the PS4 games work. It has to be there. So, do you want that link to the colors? Yes, yeah, send that to me. Yes, yeah, send that to me. Send that to me. Because uh, the possibilities with this controller are pretty damn good in terms of like oh. customizations. Yeah. Ryan, do you think that that Sony will follow Microsoft and with uh, Xbox design? Yeah, that? I agree. I agree. Afro Soul. It's the it's the it's really the color pattern that's throwing a lot of people off. Some people that might not like this color, but the design is fine. It kind of looks like the scuff. Actually, let me put that on screen. I can see my computer, so it's not like yeah. Yeah, I, I can see my. Hold on. I, I like the design. I just don't understand why this is such a big deal. <laughs> I don't know. Uh, do you think that Sony will follow up with Microsoft with the Xbox Design Labs? The what? They should. They should. That is one thing Microsoft has done well. They just have to make it cheaper. They have to. No, they ain't gonna do that. Yo, I'm gonna send you the link. 
I'm gonna send you the link to the uh, colors. Here you go. Uh, I'll send it. Let me let me show. Here it is. Oh, they changed it. So look, it has a lot in common with this. Did you see this before, Blaze? The scuff impact. Yeah, yeah, I have that. And it looks. It has a lot in common with the scuff impact. Y'all see this? Design? No, I got the scuff vantage. I'm sorry. Yeah, you got the vantage. This is the scuff impact. Let me get a better front look on this. So yeah, these are the scuff impact controllers. This is what Sony was partnering with scuff with. To make these no, controllers, that's the bandage, bro. Look at yeah, the these are the scuffs. Like the these are the scuffs. So now, if I go to what we were showing here, you see the similarities. Uh, let me go to a mm -hmm. picture where it's just the front shot. Now I want to change that blue light. There you, you go. Know, like, like I did on. It my will change. It will change depending on the player. Just like your uh, light bar has yeah, a lot in common about, here, guys. Has a lot in I common. I wanted to change colors all the time. I wanted a lot in common there. Color. You you sent it, bless. Yeah, I sent it to you. Yep. Yeah, let me check my name. Um, where'd you send it? Oh, you put Just, it in. Uh, yeah, I put it. My bad. Yeah, you I put, put it in the main. main. Sorry. Mm -hmm. That's fine. There we go. So, How, how's, the inside, <laughs> how's the inside Xbox going? Does anybody Nobody cares. Did this this no one announcement <laughs> took the wind out of inside Xbox, which is crazy. Oh my goodness! Mm -hmm. Hit that like button. Shout out to the two hundred and fifteen people here. Hit that like button. Yeah. Hit that like they button. Stuck into Microsoft. Appreciate, appreciate. I'm like, well, all they show was a controller. <laughs> <laughs> hey, they want honey. I shrunk the kids, man. I, all right, so yeah. that's, these are these are different looks. You got blue, got green, got uh, yeah, not bad. Cool. Now keep in mind, people, somebody photoshopped this in about ten minutes. So yeah, these don't these don't look that guy. that clean, but you get a point. You get a a right. reference in terms of look, so that's fine. They probably well, will have a customization thing similar to Xbox. I can see. That. Yeah, that's what I that was what I was saying. Yeah, I can see because uh, there's no way you're gonna launch a controller that has a two tone look and not fully capitalize on that with customization. No way, you're not gonna do Im that. So, right? Imagine that's a lot in common with those, but yeah, that's the look. Yeah. Right. Imagine uh, a controller that's transparent. Oh yeah, yeah. Good point. Like yeah. um, the sides can be transparent. Yeah, that'd be cool. That'd be yeah. a dope look for it. It's got possibilities. Yeah, the front, the front as well. Yeah. Maybe the touchpad. Maybe they could do something with that. You can see behind the the actual. Um, yeah, you can see the behind room? the actual touchpad. See the lights. Oh yeah, I can see mm -hmm. it. I can definitely see it. Mm -hmm. So that looks dope. That's definitely pretty cool. That is pretty cool, man. Uh, what y'all oh, think about it in the chat? Oh, wait, wait, wait. how y'all feeling I, about it? I think they got rid of the texture on the sides or the on the DualShock Five. The texture on the side. Yeah. Yeah. You, because I can't see on on the render image. Let me see. There it is. Oh, no, they did. Oh, it's, yeah. That's there. Yeah. I thought they got yeah, rid of it. It looks the same. It looks like it sits higher, maybe, but that's... And yeah, yeah for those you asking, is this the, the legit thing? Yes, it's legit. It's even on... Here, yeah. I'll go... Here, I'll, to make it even more easier for you, I'll do this for you. Go to PlayStation's Twitter. I, I'm just going to go to their PlayStation blog. I'll do that. Oh, shit. PlayStation Give me a blog. second. That's <laughs> literally on their place. It's on their blog. So if you want to, another again, you want to see it again, it's right here on the official PlayStation store, guys. It's not also, fabricated. Also, what, what Jim Ryan said is what's this. very important, guys. But it's not, it's not fabricated, guys. <laughs> this is legit. Yeah. This is it. What Jim Ryan said is also very important. So. So. No, what, what, what did he say about what? It's right there at the bottom of the screen. He said they need to get rid of that dual sense. Yeah, it's, well, it's different. It's a new style. Like they're going for something different with this controller. Bro, it's a dual shock five. That's what everybody's ever gonna call it. They need to stop with that. Dual it's a dual shock five. <laughs> oh man, that's crazy. Well, that bro, you think well, you think we're gonna go live with some fake controller, bro? <laughs> no, they they will. They you guys have been on online all day, lying their asses off. Right, but so, and Jim Ryan, but we're gonna fact too, check though. it first. Yeah, I checked this immediately me. before I even did the stream. Might actually yeah. have to read this post. I might read yeah, this. Yeah, that's very that's important. That's huge. What he says. So. 
Shout out to Eddie, 2000 Super Chase. It looks incredible. Can't wait for PS5 system. Same here, brother. It looks dope. Dual Sense, Dual Shock name is officially dead. Done. It's done. It's no. Mm -hmm. It's no longer the that. Bro, I don't care if it could if it could give you a you know <laughs> X-ray. It's a Dual Shock Five, bro. Yeah, you know? people are gonna consider. People are gonna still call it Dual Shock. Absolutely. Dude. Yeah. So it looks cool. It's it's still gonna be Dual Shock at this point. Mm -hmm. Or we're, we're still gonna be dual shot to us. <laughs> so, um, again, could this still be though? I mean, how do I feel about it? I mean, I, I already said it looks fine, but I'm wondering if they would uh, improve it any further. Like, you know, you know, like when they have like the base controls that launch, and then they'll come out with the more streamlined mm -hmm. ones. I wonder how they will refine yeah. it further. So. I mean, right. the people keep saying it, it, it's going to do this and this. It's like you don't, you haven't had it in your hands yet. So, well, these people, y'all, we don't even know what this thing feels like. Oh, so, definitely. Wow, they this, talked about know. it too. Here it is. Now, let's talk mm -hmm. about the colors. Traditionally, our base controllers have a single color, as you can see. Uh, we went a different direction this time around and decided on a two-tone design. Additionally, we changed the position of the light bar that will give it an extra pop. On DualShock 4, it sat on the top of the controller. Now it sits at each other, each um, side of the touchpad, giving it a slightly larger look and feel. In all, we mm -hmm. went through several concepts and hundreds of mock-ups over the last years um, before we settled on this final design. DualSense has been tested by a wide range of gamers with a variety of uh, hand sizes in order for us to achieve the comfort level we wanted. With great ergonomics, our goal with DualSense is to give gamers the feeling of being transported into the game world as soon as they open the box. We want gamers to feel like the controller is an extension of themselves when they are playing so much mm. that we forget they even is, that's even in our hands <laughs> so yeah. that's the fine print that's it looks good i, I got no complaints well how y'all feel in the chat put a one in the chat is this a, is this a yeah two if it's yeah, a no it, it comes with the with the up, right so yeah that's fine mm -hmm. i just mean um, that ps5 would be white uh, not uh, really, but again, you have yeah. something. But yeah, yeah this uh, this is a go. Y'all put a one in this chat. This is, if you don't like it, and, and or, or if you're undecided, or if you put put a two if you don't like it, three if you're undecided. There you go. Put that. Let's do that. Let's try. Yeah, I'm undecided because I don't know what it feels like. And as long as the old one works, the one that I have now, so overwhelming amount of uh, yeses. So a lot yeah. of you like this. It looks dope. That looks fine. I'm gonna go with three because until I put my hands on it. So you wanna, I'm you want, you like hands on, hands on the side. I need to see hands on. I'm well, say, yeah, yeah, be honest. I mean, yeah. shit, honest. Yeah. Be honest with yourself. Shit. Don't put, don't put a one or two. No, just put. Be honest. If you wanna, if you like it, but you, you're undecided because you wanna, you know, you wanna test it in your hands. Yeah. Put a three. Shit. But I love good. the color. But it looks fine. Yeah, I love the color, but I need to test that. I out really got to see it. Yeah, I gotta see this thing in action. I really have to see this in action. I really want to see this thing in action. How well does this thing go? How well does yeah. it perform? You What's know? the battery life? The battery yeah, life, I improved. think they improved. I really do think they but, improved. But they didn't. USB-C charges fast. Yeah. So That's we'll see. Plus for me. Yeah, it's better than having double A batteries in a damn control. <laughs> That's for damn sure. Yeah. Now, where would the USB go? Where would it go at? The USB-C. <laughs> uh, in, in the back. Dude. In the back. Same, the back. same way that you do with every controller. God damn. Oh, so it's gonna be in the front. That's oh the front. god. Oh lord. Well, let's uh, let's read the fine. I didn't even read this full thing. I just read the fine print. My bad. My bad. Shout. My bad. Right. Everybody in the chat. After thoughtful consideration, we decided to keep uh, much of what gamers love about DualShock Four intact, while also adding new functionality and refining the design. Based on our discussions with developers, we concluded that the sense of touch with within gameplay, much like audio, hasn't been a big focus for many games. We had a great opportunity with PS5 to innovate by offering game creators the ability to explore how they can heighten that feeling of immersion through our new controllers or our new controller this is why we adopted haptic feedback which adds a variety of powerful sensations you'll feel when you play such as the slow grittiness of driving cars through mud we also incorporate adaptive triggers into the l2 and r2 buttons of dual sense so you can feel the tension of your actions like when you're drawing a bow 
and of course an arrow now again that was something we talked about before but again they clarified uh, further yeah. this uh, yeah. this provided us with an exciting challenge to design a new controller that builds off of the current generation while taking into account the new features we were adding for example with adapted triggers we had the we had to consider how the components would fit into the hardware without giving it a bulky feeling our design team worked closely with our hardware engineers to place the triggers and actuators um, the designers were then able to uh, draw the lines of how the exterior of the controller would look and feel with a challenge of making the controller feel smaller than it really looks and in the end we changed the angle of the um, hand triggers and also made some subtle updates to the grip we also took thoughtful consideration into ways to maintain a strong battery life for dual senses rechargeable battery and to lessen the weight of the controller as much as possible as new features were added. For the buttons, you'll notice there is no longer a share button as we had with DualShock 4. Don't worry, it's not going away. In fact, we've built upon the success of our industry's first share button to bring you a new create button feature. With create, uh, once you're, uh, I'm sorry, with Crate, we're once again pioneering new ways for players to create epic gameplay content to share with the world or just to enjoy for themselves. We'll have more details for this future as we get closer to launch. DualSense also adds a built in microphone array, which will enable players to easily chat with friends without a headset. Ideal for jumping into a quick conversation, but of course, if you are planning to chat for a longer period, it's good to have that headset handy. Well, so it does have a headset built in. Blaze. Yeah. <laughs> Where Blaise oh, going? a built-in headset? The headset's built into the controller. Well, I mean, but it's going to have the 3D audio. Now, don't get me wrong. What I like yeah. is seeing something that's written on paper. Now we see it. Now we see what what they were going. Holy for. shit! Okay, so, but um, so the I mic's like in the though. damn controller. Oh, holy shit! Yeah. yeah, yeah, that's actually neat. That's that's neat. cool. That's that cool. would be yeah. neat. That's Blaise, a neat feature. <sighs> he plays. Oh god, he did that. He missed. Second. He missed. The, he missed me answering that question. He asked, "Is the yeah. mic? In the it's, in, it's in here. It's a mic in this damn thing. Holy shit! That's a. So do you think that they're gonna uh, bring in the what was it the cheap cheap ass head? That's it. Well, it's a 3D audio. So. Nah, it's built in. They don't, you don't yeah, need it. In. It has it already built in the controller. But they did Boop. say if for a longer extended use, they recommend you get a headset. So I'm wondering if uh, how that battery is going to be, you know? I'm wondering how that's mm. going to or how Or how Good reliable point. that mic is. Mm, Good point. I am, I am interested in seeing how it is. Now, they give you a quality mic inside this controller, um, and it does stand out pretty good. I think that'll be okay, but at the same time, it is kind of required that you have a a headset. They're pretty much alluding to that. You'll probably need a headset if you want to really yeah. look at it. So that's pretty cool. Oh, shit. Sure. Let me. Uh, you might, you might have to test it out once. It I'm comes, testing this once. out. I'm going to do everything mm -hmm. on this. This looks really cool. Yeah. It yeah. looks really damn uh, cool. Oh, uh, fortunately, now it's not compatible with the. PS4 back button accessory. Well, obviously, yeah, different design. The the this whole yeah. thing is shaped more so like a scuff impact controller. It's scu it's mm -hmm. more shaped like this. It has this shape. It has a lot in common with this. This is why I keep. I know I keep stressing this to you guys in the chat, but it has a lot in common with this shape. Which again, it has a lot in common with this. Just oh, more yeah. refined to their specifications. So yeah. That's crazy. Sony dropped the damn controller, all the controller details in the middle of an inside Xbox. <laughs> so, uh, I'm sorry. Oh shit. There you go. More colors. Shout out to uh, Samurai. I see. Thank oh, you. Colors. Okay. That, the, now, those... these look good. These look cool. Where's yeah. Blaze at? Yo, yeah. where, 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 yeah. Blaze missing everything. God damn. Yeah. Look cool. that, that looks cool. Here's, I hope Sony follows around with Microsoft Blade and do it. Out some other shit. That was cool. Look at these colors. I hope, <laughs> yeah, I hope they start uh, implementing a Xbox what design. Is that pink or blood? I'm guessing that's candy. I don't know what the kind of candy color. I don't know. Some of these uh, custom designs are going to be interesting to look at. But what, what were you about to say? 
I hope they follow the route as Microsoft introduced a design lab. Uh, I can definitely see them definitely introducing a design lab. I can see them. The yeah, question is when, you know, when, when would they attempt it? I want to see this yeah. thing in red. I, I really would like to see this in red. See yeah. how it really looks, but uh, two uh, different shades of red. Maybe? Yeah, two different shades of red, maybe uh, or maybe like it, silver. You know, go with some some cool highlights. Some that'd be cool. Uh, gold, maybe. Maybe a cyberpunk colored one. You know, yellow Ew. and black. Yeah. <laughs> black hey. yellow, like black uh, nah, black nah, bricks, black, black on the sides okay, with right. with uh, yellow. This no, Cyberpunk no, no. gives me her my god Gersburns. Oh, you, were, so, you just you just don't like games. That's what you don't like. No, I just I, a game called Cyberpunk. No, it's yeah. called Cyberpunk. Yeah, like Cyberpunk. Right, right, right. If imagine God of War two on this PS five is a limited edition. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Oh my god. I you <laughs> you ain't even gotta say that. That's like, I'm already buying yeah. Spider Man two as it is, but. Yeah, a Spider-Man no. version of this, it's already a got God the blue, War? guys. Keep in mind, it's already got the blue in the um in the actual light bar. Oh, with the, the Spider-Man red, logo on the some white logo on the front. Yep. Maybe a web pattern on the where the grip side is. Oh yeah. Or maybe or maybe a Venom one. Yeah, that'd be yeah. dope. What yeah. about the price of the controller? Uh, it's two dollars. Super from Eddie. Uh, honestly, they did not talk about pricing of this thing. I'm guessing it sixty com- bucks. It, 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 well, it comes with the with the system. It comes with the system, but he's talking about buying yeah. it separately, like to buy oh, a place. Yeah, sixty nine. It'll probably be the same as the other one. Sixty nine. Yeah. Sixty nine. You mean you mean fifty? Sixty five. Isn't it? Well, whatever. The, whatever the other one's called, brand new. Wait, there's sixty I mean, five brand new. The dual shot force. Let me let me see. I thought there was sixty nine. Oh wait, there's sixty nine. Uh, I think they're like. They're like sixty bucks, I think. Okay. So yeah, sixty right bucks. Now. I mean, I'm, 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 again, I better be able to play Mass yeah. Effect with that new, with that new game pad on that PS5. Yeah, I don't see okay, it being seventy paid, bucks. There's like only one he, company I can think of that can get away with charging you seventy bucks for a controller. Nintendo. Well, <laughs> I mean, these games Nintendo. they're showing on inside Xbox look like hot garbage. The what? I'm talking about these games on Inside Xbox. They show the oh, dude, I'm not even bothered watching it. I'm just not. I'd, yeah. I'd rather well, not. Uh, I'd rather not like torture myself for watching that. Trash. Yeah. <clears throat> I have to talk about this tomorrow on my podcast. Oh, uh, no. Oh, well, oh, I, I, tomorrow's the, the biggest, the big Xbox podcast. Yeah, I can see it going up a little bit. Uh, 64, maybe 64.99 mm-hmm. or something, maybe. What, you, and what about if they do introduce that? Should they uh, build it? Yeah, if it's built right. Yeah. yeah. Right, so, uh, what would you about to say? Uh, how, how much do you think that they'll price it up if if it, if they do introduce a design lab? If they what? If they do introduce a design lab for the PS5? Oh, uh, now that's that can vary I, because that's really yeah. up to the user, right? So that can vary. Yeah. It's always a slippery slope with that type of stuff because it depends on how much you're willing to pay. Maybe they'll yeah. charge you. I'm guessing maybe you'll. Yeah, I see. Maybe now we're going because now we're going into the lines of this. Yeah, and let's mm-hmm. see. Let's use this as an example. So let's make let's make one for you guys live in the chat. Let's let's let's, let's try something here. Uh, so well, uh, we're going well, into I'm this gonna, realm, y'all. Uh, this is just white and stuff like that. We're going into this realm, and controllers could hit that price if they had a design law. Well, that's could true. keyword could hit hit that price if they went all yeah, out and change stuff, you know? Point. Yeah. Oh, so. like you mean like modding? Well, I mean, there ain't no modding, but you know, you get what I'm saying. Different colors, stuff like that. I can see prices and replacing the thumb grips. Is there a Probably. black one? You mean like this? <laughs> now that one looks okay to me. Again, looks uh, good. Yeah, I like that a lot better. I'll probably rock with the stealth black type of thing Car- for sure. Carlos has spent was two bucks. Super chat, no, and he said no LCD screen. No, it okay. So this is why I that said for, this will go into pricing again. An LCD screen would drop. You'd be paying hundred dollars for this damn controller. 
Oh yeah, definitely, definitely. For, with an LCD not. screen, you don't want an LCD. That's screen. a huge bitch. That's no. why they kept the 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 touchpad. The touchpad just simple for again for the transition of PS4 games to five, mm. so they can yep. play. That's that's it. Mm. But you're not getting no LCD screen. No, no, no. That that would be mm. ludicrous to put an LCD screen on this thing. All uh, right, definitely. I so, do not see that. Yeah, you're not gonna get that, bro. But um, yeah. If we're talking about customization, and they ever had like a store like Microsoft, so they do that. Um, there you go. Build yours on. So let's build one again. <laughs> we're just gonna build one. So it could be something similar to this, guys. You'll have colors, and then they'll have different custom textured ones, right? So oh yeah. Mm -hmm. Let's go. This controller do looks like that. I ain't gonna lie, but um. So I say if I just went with white. And you can go with like signature design and stuff. See, I'm pretty sure that's probably what these prices are more likely going to hit if Sony ever went that route where they had customization <laughs> and stuff like that. So, again, um, I would say tread tread thinly on that stuff if you guys really want that. Just tread thinly on it because eventually it could happen when you have this. But wonder how Scuff's going to react to this. I can already see Scuff improving even further from this. Uh, to this, so that's gonna be pretty. I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm more like gonna wait. I'm not even gonna wait till we get to the first scuff. I'm probably gonna wait till like the second iteration of that before we before yeah. I ever buy another scuff because I actually have one, not this one, but I have the other one, the original. So there's that, but yeah, customization is definitely possible with this, uh, with this controller. Yeah, I'm uh, customization is there. Yep. So who's watching that? Um, that build mic's going to sound they like got this shit. Thing uh, I doubt it. I was just thinking, well, I, mean, I got you. No, I, actually, I can't even say thing. I doubt it because I haven't heard it. You know, I haven't heard it. Uh, if it sounds, I mean, because I again, I thought that that cheap headset that you were going to get with PS4. Yeah, I remember the cheap one, the little one, earbud microphone. Yeah, <laughs> that actually sounds okay for a lot of people. It doesn't sound bad. It's just it's cheap. Yeah, <laughs> it's a cheap. It's, 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 it's the most it's the most uncomfortable headset to be honest with you. Yeah. Ryan, check your DMs. Yeah, yeah this it's like, the most it's the most uncomfortable looking headset of all time. Yeah, but yet it, like it gets the job done. It sounds very clear. Yeah. Um. Uh, so Ryan, check your D uh, your Discord DM. I sent you a Cyberpunk twenty seven seventy seven Xbox. Version. A cyberpunk oh. Xbox version. Well, yeah. Look at. You did not. Uh -huh. Yeah, they did. Uh, in the DM, <laughs> or you put it in the Discord. DM you in your DM it. Discord. Oh god, this one. <laughs> oh, that shit out of here. Let's try. Uh. <laughs> That's the best they can do. And how much does that cost them? Like it's eighty bucks. Eighty uh, dollars. Yeah. So yeah, if they were to do that, they would have to be cheap. But yeah. <laughs> these controllers, I don't see them doing it just yet, though. You're not not right out the gate. This would have to be yeah. on the market for at least three years. Mm -hmm. At least, right? Give or take. Everybody in the chat, would you agree with that? I would say three years on the market. Then you'll see Sony incorporate like a customization store, if they actually wanted to do that for DualShock Fives uh, controllers or for yeah for DualShock. I would keep. Oh, Ryan wants a pink controller. Oh, that's Don. Don wanted them pink one. Don't even try it. Keep oh. the mic is pink. So it has to be like three years on the market before you get something like that. But I mean, yeah, it looks fun. I like it. I dig it. I really do dig yeah. it. Like the logo. I like it. Looks sleek. Um. Can't wait to see the games. That's what I really want to see, too. But at least we know what we're <laughs> going to be playing on. Does look futuristic in design. So I'm happy about that. Looks fine. Yep. I like that they kept the light bar, but they made it more. They didn't make it intrusive, right? They didn't make it look pointless. They made it, like, you know, cool looking. It actually serves a purpose. It makes the controller, like, more cool looking. You know, it looks like a futuristic. It looks like something from Tron. You remember that movie Tron? It looks like something from Tron. So it looks. it reminds me of something from Tron. So mm -hmm. that looks fine. No issues there at all. Glad they're uh, they're good. They're ready to go. So this definitely confirms to me that they're definitely on track for sure for the release. It's just a question of when we're going to get the console reveal. And that's probably going to be in June at this point. Definitely. Maybe around, yeah, the, that's probably in June. around E3. Like yeah. around the time of E3. 
more likely around the time of E3, they'll probably do something of their own. That, that depends on the pandemic. The pandemic slows down by September. I don't know. We'll say. Mm, we'll definitely yeah, say. It, it always starts slowing down by, by yeah, we'll, we'll definitely mid, say. mid-June. Yeah, so they're, they're pretty much done. So, guys, if the controller is looking like this and you're <laughs> done with the design, uh, this thing, you know, mm. I don't want to think about tomorrow. No? Oh. <laughs> mm. So yeah, offset, I agree with you, yeah. Notorious. It doesn't look that great. Like it's offsetting with with like with this particular color pattern, right? And it could look a lot better with different color patterns. I mean, people <clears> are making <throat> mock-ups. Like it looks good yeah. here, like different color patterns and stuff, right? But really, the look that stands out for me is this one, mm-hmm. the black, just the, the all black design. This <clears> looks more yeah. setting. Well, if this if this is the one that comes with it, I'll keep it, especially if the console the black matches yeah. the color scheme. With the all black. Imagine, imagine the thirty-year uh, PlayStation edition. The three-year yeah, one. The thirty-year uh, PlayStation edition one. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, yeah, Sony. yeah. 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 They go all. They go back to the traditional PS One with the traditional colors of the buttons and the logo. Yeah. I, I can point. see that. Yeah, I can see it. Mm-hmm. I can definitely see it. Uh, let me go to my, what's the name here? Shout out to, uh, Toothpick for following, <laughs> or for subscribing, appreciate it. But, uh, <laughs> just, uh, I guess his name is Toothpick. <laughs> uh, don't be a menace, uh, reference Hello, there, toothpick. that's funny. <laughs> Galway, my son, hey, yo, son, what you think about the controller? This is it in black, but the one that Sony showed... This from rare. What you think, son? Well, why is the Xbox one trending on Twitter? It says Xbox controller, and Uh-oh. they're showing a picture of the PlayStation one. <laughs> 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 hey, uh, hey, it, got, it, it does. Uh, it does have similarities. I, I ain't gonna bullshit you. Yeah. It does. It has similarities. It looks exactly. Well, there's one that says new PlayStation. Uh, shout out to uh, to Big Cloud's good friend, the Crab Gamer said it. Yeah, he said it's running. The sources are saying that the new controller is running hot. So uh, now the switch, <laughs> the switch, the Switch Pro is uh that's trending. Switch Pro oh, the Switch Pro is, is trending too. Yeah, it's trending. So, right now, yeah. all this is trending. Uh, it says yeah for me. It says Switch Pro. It's World Health Day. Well, guess what? People are getting sick. Oh, uh, I got oh, let's celebrate our heroes. That's for me. Uh, then it says new P- Switch See, Pro. Trending. said new PS5. I thought the PS5 was being shown. Oh, <laughs> and then it, it says is. Xbox controller. Then the PS5. Damn, really? Hey, yeah. he ain't got he got a point. Okay, that does look <laughs> it looks pretty damn similar to Switch Pro. Y'all see this? Look at this. Yeah, that does look similar to Switch Pro. <laughs> What's the same picture? Uh, no, nah, it looks exactly the same as Switch Pro. Oh, uh, yeah, it does have to be like the Switch Pro looks a little. See, that looks more bulky. Oh, okay. I see what they're doing. Yeah, they're yeah, doing their show. Okay. Um, yeah, it doesn't look as sleek. What's a, the Switch one looks a little more bulky, but yeah, it's, it's not a call it's, the stadium knockoff. Oh God, here we yeah, go, guys. The trolling like, yeah. begins, and so it begins. Uh-huh. <laughs> oh Lord. Well, what y'all think, no. man? I, yeah, I already said you guys liked it. You guys said you liked it, but what else is trending over here? PS Five. Yeah, pretty much PS5. Yeah, it's the main thing troll or trending, I should say. But where it says Xbox controller, <laughs> then it says trending with PS5. Shout out to shout out to Kofi. He right though. They Oh, they petty for that. They is petty for that. They legit took the the wind out of the inside Xbox show for with that. Well, I'm looking at some show. of the games. Even man, though nobody was really talking about inside Xbox, but still, they they took the wind out the show with this. I mean, they're showing cats on a boat right now. It's not so, planned. No, no, I'm serious. I mean, I don't to see a thief, so. So they're showing off. So are you? You're watching this. You're actually watching this. Yeah, it's on. I mean, they oh, show a rag. Oh, Jesus. It like, it's like something you would wipe your butt with. So, and uh, they look like straight. So far, it's straight trash. So. <laughs> yeah. Uh, shit. I mean, nobody knew it was a thing today. That's the the crazy part. Yeah. 
Now, when, when is the next state of play? Have they announced it? No word yet, but I'm thinking they're just waiting for things to calm down. I honestly do. I was going to do a stream today or a video today. I might either just do a video or I might sit that for tomorrow. But I wasn't talking about uh, what, um, what's your name he was talking about? It was Review Tech USA. You made a good point. But I don't know. I don't know if it'll be delayed, though. It's interesting. Oh, about, oh, about the Xbox and the Getting delayed. Yeah. 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 He, he I, had a lot I of people attacking him. And I was like, damn. Yeah. I mean, he's got a point, well, though. It could get delayed. Both of them could get delayed. We yeah, very well Jim couldn't Ryan get the S5 the day. to one. Hmm? Jim Ryan just said today that they were on pace for holiday 2020. So they did uh, say that, but when you got taken yeah. into account, the market. Oh no, you're right. I yeah, think they will be the market. both delayed till till late February, early March, which is yeah. still Q, still Q1. It's just later in in the quarter. So it's just yeah. reality. Yeah, it's the so. market. It's the market really at this point. Mm -hmm. So far though, so far though, um, not bad, not bad at all. A, a big surprise. I'm happy with it. Liking this. I definitely do like this. Uh, DualShock 4. I love my DualShock 4. I think and I will. This would be a nice upgrade. So looking forward to definitely playing Spider-Man 2, God of War 2, Horizon Zero Dawn 2, whatever else I get my hands on on this, man. This is a uh, this looks good. One last time in the chat. If y'all dig it, put a one, put a two. If you don't, put a three. If you got to uh, try it out yourself to make an opinion. But hit that like button because I'm about to shut this down for sure. Shout out to everybody who came through. Hope you guys enjoyed this, man. This is uh, it's not bad. It's not bad. It's mm -hmm. not bad at all. I'm not even going to bullshit. It's not bad. It's a lot more cleaner than I thought it was going to be. Mm-hmm. At first, when I first saw it, I thought it was more or less like a damn um, concept controller. I was like, nah, there's no way that's the real thing. And then Sony posts on the page like, yep, this is it. <laughs> My dual sense is tingling. <laughs> Actually, there might be a damn, you never know, that might be a damn thing in the damn uh, Spider-Man 2. Your controller shakes when your spider sense goes off. Dual sense. It tingles. So, yeah. That's that. Uh, what y'all think? What y'all think? What's your rating on it so far? I mean, again, I, for me personally, until I physically you don't like get it my all? hands on it, me? Yeah, you don't I like think the it's look. okay. I think it's okay. Oh, I think it looks fine, uh, but I don't know what it's going to, what's, what, what kind of feel is it going to have? So uh, okay. that's why I gave it a three. I like the way it looks, but, um, but you got to try. try. Trying is yeah, believing me. Try yeah, try it out. How's it gonna react on to the to the PlayStation? Now, if they release the PlayStation picture, I can have a lot better. Because to me, to show the PlayStation with the controller, yeah. you know. But again, that's I understand what they did. I guess they did want to quote unquote stick it to Microsoft. So uh, <laughs> hopefully that hopefully that answers your question, Craven. Yeah, it's it's on the official page. Yeah, okay. it, it is official. Lobo, what's your thoughts, bro? Okay, he probably dipped out. <laughs> and Blaze dipped mm -hmm. out too, right? I guess they all dipped out. All right, well, there you guys right. go, man. This was uh, pretty cool. It's only uh, <laughs> not the wind out of the, out of what's the name's little inside Xbox with this. Completely out the whim and blew me away with this. Uh, you said fake nudes is from PlayStation themselves on their official blog. <laughs> But okay. Yeah, I gotta. I have to agree. It's not fake news. <laughs> <laughs> it is not fake news. Is that the touchpad? Yes, the touchpad from DualShock Four is on this. Uh, they carried it over. Reason why? And uh, <laughs> I know you're kidding. I just you know you know how you gotta be strategic. You gotta say it because you know people look at it weird in the chat. But anyway, um, the touchpad on this is from DualShock 4, and the reason why it's on this is to make that transition from 4 to 5, because remember, PS5 is going to have enhanced titles of PS4 games, so you're going to have those enhanced versions, but also it's backwards compatible with Dual with um, with uh, PS4 games, and they have to work, so you need that. So it's the only way to make that work, but they made it more flush, and they added the light bar underneath it, Obviously, have the trigger feedback, all that, it works as advertised. So, we just got to see the end result. What's up, Jemai? 
Uh, Dwarf said it's treated with special antibacterial. Oh my god. Yeah, stupid. But no, I'm happy with it. I'm so, yeah. It's got me. They got me, man. They got me. When I first saw it, I thought scuff 4PS, but and I saw this color, I was like, okay, this color's got potential, but I can see this more likely being the final look for when we get it all black. But if they have a white and black controller, the console could very well be white and black or black or white, like highlights of it, you know, different sections of it, maybe. There's a lot of possibilities with this type of two-tone look. Like, they can have different customization or not just aside from different different uh, customization, they can have cooler like special editions. Like y'all already know we're gonna get another Star Wars game, right? Imagine like R two D two, yeah. Imagine like a, a R two D two inspired controller or console. See what I'm saying? Or what was that? Um, what was that little droid called? Uh, Craig, was it BD? Uh, BB eight. BB eight, yeah, like a BB eight uh, colored uh, control or something like that, like stuff like that. It's going to look cool. Spider Man, God of War. Um, I'm not sure what the hell David Cage is working on. He always works with something new, so it's not like I can say Detroit too. <laughs> it's not making another Detroit. I'm about to do a Rise of Dawn skin for the. There you go. Rise of Dawn could look cool, metallic like silver. Have it look like the robots. I, yeah, yeah. I mean, again, I, I just want to yeah. know what the what it's going to feel like in my hand. That's I think, all. I, I know, think you're good. They said they tested this with stuff. with numerous gamers, yeah. different uh, yes. different hand sizes, and it works yeah. fine. So again, I know, I know. Obviously, our our feeling is the one that matters. So I can't really say much uh, about it neither. I got to try it myself, but it looks it looks fine. I I think it looks fine. It looks dope. And it's got the built-in mic, so it's like they got rid of the cheap headset, and they put the headset into the actual controller. Hence, why it has the mute button here. So the mute, the con the microphone is indeed in the controller. That's innovative. That's different. The haptic yeah. feedback controllers, the the uh, triggers, which we talked about before, and the patents are bigger. They are bigger. Those those analog sticks are bigger. Or, I mean, those um those triggers are bigger. So yeah. 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 No elite controller. Um, I wouldn't put that out just yet, right? I can see that happening in the future, not now, not now. I don't see them doing it now. Keep no, in mind, they already tested the water with that elite thing, with that um, that controller attachment for DualShock Four with the paddles. They did try it already, so I'm not. I'm wondering if that didn't sell. The way they were hoping it would sell, you know. So yeah. keep that in mind too. But I think they'll probably introduce something like that as well. And yes, USB C. Yeah. Oh, good night, Don, or goodbye, Don. But um, yeah, but yeah, I'm a I'm a bounce off too. So you bounce off too. And, uh, All right, yeah, well, go ahead, I'm, tell I'm people where to find you, uh, Craig. Oh yeah, you can find me. Oh hell, they know who I am. But I yeah, like, you're uh, regular. Come over but and, uh, <laughs> I have some new yeah, faces here. <laughs> and, uh, yeah, that's true. Uh, yeah, just join, uh, follow me on Twitter if you dare, if you want to know the truth. And I got my own little podcast, a little mini dog poo show. I do it at eleven o'clock in the mornings when I'm off. So I'm, I am off tomorrow, so I'll be able to do one. I will be missing RGT this Friday because I do work uh, this Friday. So, um, but yeah. Uh, everybody just come out, come out tomorrow morning. We'll look at this thing, and we'll talk about the PS. I guess PS now. It's got some uh, the Spider Man. And, yeah, uh, Spider Man's uh, yeah. going to PS now. Yeah. So yeah. So and then um, the other games that went to PS Plus, the Uncharted and stuff mm -hmm. like that. So uh, I'm right. gonna be talking about that. So and then I'm yeah, I gotta watch Inside Xbox and go over that doll trash. That I just <laughs> saw. So, yeah, but yeah, I'll be talking about it. I'll have to, I'll have to add that to the queue. But um, yeah, so I'll be talking about that, and um, that's that's pretty much it. I mean, uh, it would, I I like the the look of the thing. I just need to feel what it's like in my hand. So I agree. Um, yeah, uh, you have a point. Yeah. I agree with you for sure. That's uh, yeah. looks fine. But okay, I'll uh, yeah, I'll see you uh, next week, brother. Yeah, yeah. Or you can always hop on tomorrow. It's gonna be on that bootleg podcast. So oh, that uh, the, the, the the discount OBS. Yeah, I mean, uh, discount the OBS. discount uh, <laughs> hangouts. Well, I, I would I would stop doing stream yards so I can figure out how to bring up the articles and have them on my screen. So, um, well, like Marlon does. Huh? 
Huh? Like how Marlon set up kind of. Well, how you just did your how you just did yours and you brought up that picture. So I got to Oh, I just this that. that's all OBS. You just you just open up yeah. a monitor. You just set a monitor thing. Oh, okay. Well, yeah, I see? just learned to do that. So yeah. Let's look at the screen. But, uh, see, here, see the screen? So that says monitor. That's what you're looking at. But if I do this, you see that? Yeah, I see that. Yeah. Yeah. So. Yeah, that's, that's, I gotta learn how to do that. So yeah. yeah that's somebody in the chat. I'll walk you through it. And, hey, right. it took yeah. you like five seconds to understand the <laughs> the what's the name. So yeah. that's that's not gonna take long. But All yeah, right, man. Old, All so, right. Yeah, but I'll talk to you. Yeah, somebody put a rip inside X. Well, I mean, the games that I saw look like trash, but I have to go back and look at the whole thing. Yeah, I'm so, gonna have to watch that as well and see what that's about. But um, yeah. Appreciate it, man. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, this was uh, the Dual Shock Five, aka now it's called the Dual Sense. It looks cool. Looks really, really cool. I'm digging it. Uh, took a minute for me to look at it. when I first looked at. I was like, "What are they doing?" Type of thing, you know. And I seen it. I was like, "Okay, you know what? I see possibilities with that, but it looks cool." So that's pretty big. That looks dope. And of course, <laughs> this is the color that I'm vouching for. All black. So. That's what I'm definitely vouching for. Yeah, that's the official controller. It's on the PlayStation block. Let me close that. So, yeah, that's it, man. That's but, it, bro. Oh, you saw it? Oh, you missed you missed a detail, bro, that I went over about this. The headset? Rather, we're talking about the microphone? Yes. It's built into the controller. Yeah, bro, I said that on my stream. Are you not listening? I missed it. I dipped out. I had to dip out. I know you said yeah, that. Yeah, it has a built-in mic like the Vita, bro. Yeah, so that's cool. So, yeah. Isn't they that gave you a cheap awesome? headset. So, you got the headset. So, yeah, you guys got a headset. So, that's cool. Bro, and that works seamless. You don't got to plug nothing. You just mm -hmm. talk. Very seamless. Very, very, very seamless. Um, yeah, that's awesome. That's pretty much it, though. We're going to shut this down. <laughs> Shout out to you guys in the chat. Hope you guys enjoyed this again. I will see you guys, I guess, tomorrow. As uh, we we adjusted all the heat problems. We fixed everything with the with the rig. So your boy will be back the first thing tomorrow. But uh, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see. That rig looking react. clean, man. Hell yeah. Your, your, your PC looking real nice right now, man. Thank you. Thank you. I had to show everybody that. Uh, <laughs> new I had to literally go all out with my cable management for that one. But Professional, dog. I have to. Got to, bro. Got to. But, um, yeah, that was it, man. Shout out to uh, Lincoln Lald, who uh, subscribed. Appreciate you, brother. Thank you. See you guys on the next one, man. Y'all be blessed. Hit that like button. We out of here. Peace.